Hi, I'm Mark Tuart, and welcome to our video series, Why Automotive Dealerships Struggle. Video 20 today is bad processes. What do we mean by bad processes? Well, let me give you an example. Recently, we mystery shopped at the request of a couple of dealerships uh, on an internet uh, lead. We sent in a lead through their organic website to let them see how they could handle it. Well, here's what we got from the three dealerships. Virtually nothing. We got an autoresponder back. Those autoresponders did not have anything written in them that would be good copywriting, that would have a good call to action, that would get anybody excited. Only one of the three gave us a phone call, the other two did not. And on the phone call that we got, well, it had a bad phone process. Now, when somebody walks in your dealership, you say, well, I've got 20 year veterans, they know what the sales process is. Okay, but it could be a bad process. Let me give you an example. Over 80 some percent of transactions have trade-ins, but when do you address it? Usually at the appraisal. It's a comfort zone, home, work, car, that's where people spend their lives. They bring it to you. Why wouldn't you want to shove it up front, get people there, get them excited about their car because they just got slammed on their car at the previous dealership. You want to get people to data dump with you. How does that happen? They get to their dealership, I mean, excuse me, their trade-in at your dealership, but they feel comfortable because it's their comfort zone. You're taking them out of an uncomfortable place and putting them into a comfortable place, which is their car. They're now going to data dump and tell you all the things that you need to do to help them buy a car. In your process, when you greet somebody, is your standard greeting, hi folks, welcome to ABC Motors, uh, how can I help you today? Pretty bad. I can take 98% of those, I'm just looking, I'm just shopping away by having a better meet and greet process. Do you have a process that takes an internet lead and, and comfortably, if this is your process, hands them to a salesperson from the appointment center in BDC, if that's the way things are set up at your dealership? What I'm finding is almost always, and I'm not going to say almost, I'm going to say every time, that a dealership is struggling. They are, they are not communicating, but they're not executing a good process. A lot of their processes are very poor, but they're not analyzing the process to say, what can we do in each step to make it better? I promise you, if I just take phone scripts and make them better, your process will be much better. If I take your email templates and rewrite them and make them strong with good marketing ideas, call to actions, reasons to pick you versus somebody else, you'll do better. If I change your meet and greet or the trade evaluation, you'll do better. Make sure you tune into the rest of our video series and uh, check out the other things about why dealerships struggle. Go to our website at tuart.com, get my free email newsletter, call us anytime at 888-2-TUART, and as always, here's to you and good selling.